everyone, this is John for Joy Super Cold Phone Reviews. I'm B. What have we gotten ourselves into? Hey everyone, how's it going? That's right, we've got another Joey's World Tour food review video that we're going to be looking at. You know, the guy's positive energy, it's contagious, and I love watching his videos. Now, I don't want to waste a ton of time with this intro, so as always, if you guys enjoy the video, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe, but only if you enjoy the video. Now, let's get to it. How is it going today, muchachos and muchachos? Well, as an honorary muchacho, I'd say it's going all right. I'm at the beer schnitzel. We have ways to make you talk. <laughs> okay. I'm doing their tapatio chili cheese fries. Tapatio chili cheese fries. You know, I can respect that. I'm pretty excited, actually. I, I'm a sucker for, for you know, the, the, if there's a good french fry, there's not a lot of foods that can beat that. And then when you mix other things in with the french fries, just to make a little french fry salad, that, that gets pretty delicious. And she looks marvy. Look at that. So let's see what's inside. Alrighty, muchachos and muchachas. This is the Dead Wiener Schnitzel's Tapatio Chili Cheese Fries. It comes with uh, golden brown french fries topped with uh, Wiener Schnitzel's world famous secret recipe chili. That looks kind of gross. Usually when they review food, or usually if people just have food that they're serving out there, it can be kind of hard for a lot of these businesses, a lot of these restaurants to make food look bad, is what I'm trying to say. But that looks gross. Everything actually, I should say, looks fine. Except for the cheese. I feel like usually when you say you're going to have some chili cheese fries or you're going to have something that has a cheese that's supposed to be drizzled over it, it's not solid chunks. It's not solid, chunk, solid chunks of cheese like this. I was expecting more of like a nacho cheese kind of thing going on there, not these strands. It looks like they just took a hunk of frozen cheese, heated it up a little bit in the microwave, but you know like the inside's still a little cold and they just plopped it right on top. That looks gross. Melted shredder, shredded cheddar cheese. Yeah, man, not melted. Jalapeno slices and tapatio hot sauce. And it comes in uh, regular and large sizes. This is like three sixty nine. This is the Wiener Schnitzel's tapatio chili cheese fries. What size do you think Joey got? Wee, 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 wee. What did you think about that? Pretty neat stuff. I love Tapatio hot sauce. You know what I love? How you have that fork just sitting in there like that. It's, It looks cool. It looks like something that was staged like that. I mean, obviously it's staged. He's making the video. But it's better than if the fork was just in the bag. It makes it look like, I don't know, it adds a little bit of class to this meal. I love it on my eggs, on my enchiladas, on my chimichangers. <laughs> On my uh, cereal, on my pancakes. I love Tapatio. Is he talking about hot sauce on his pancakes and his cereal? It better be a joke. Let me know what you guys have to say about this chili, these chili fries, though. They, they're just not doing anything for me. Let me know in the comments down below. Would you? Like, does that look good? I wouldn't. I personally, I wouldn't eat that. And so, uh, that wiener schnitzel, we have ways to make you talk. Um, we have ways to make you talk. That's nice, dude. I like when he does his accent. They have it on now their chili cheese fries and we got the jalapenos and that beautiful cheddar cheese and i'm really excited about the jalapenos you know when cheese is melted it's supposed to when you when you split it apart it's supposed to have these strands that hold it together a little bit so like, because it's all melting it's all fusing together i might have seen like one or two strands but for the most part those are those are maybe just he heated up little shreds of cheddar cheese look at that Mm -hmm -hmm. So, this is going to be a little spicy, I'm thinking. So, let's check this out, everyone. Wee, 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 wee. Wee, 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 wee. Down the hatch. Mmm. He's got to process it. He's got to, he's really just got to let everything just fall into place. The universe is zen. And he'll figure it out. Don't you worry. We have the different textures going here. We have the jalapeno, the tapatio, the fries. Oh, uh, don't mind me.
Ooh, I can really taste the dew in this one. The cheddar cheese, the chili, and then the uh, the heat from the uh, the top of the jalapeno just kind of it's slowly building up, which is really good. Fascinating. He's a man of exquisite tastes. Mm. So if you're gonna get this, definitely get a drink. This is really good vittles. Mm. Mm. So good. I really like this. Look at that. Love the jalapenos. Yeah, we can see it, dude. Cool it. Mmm. That top two sauce is awesome. I don't think I've ever even heard of a place called Wiener Schnitzel. Is it good? Let me know. Have you guys been there? Let me know if it's good. Also, let me know where they're at. Woo! Turn down the heat on us. Yeah. So yum skis, everyone. You need to get your Davina Schnitzel and try this Tapatio chili cheese fries. Mmm. Yeah, I get that it's good, dude, but I'm getting nervous. Every time, you need to hold that a little bit closer to your body, because every time he scoops up... Move this a little bit. Every time he scoops up a little bit of food, <laughs> he, there's this little, there's a little area, it's, it's the valley of death, right in between the, the place where his fries are and where his mouth is, where he could drop that, and it could fall right onto his shirt, and it makes me nervous, man. I don't want him to ruin his brown polo. You want me to we probably be good. I see he has a shirt pocket there on his brown polo. It'd probably fall right in there. It'd be like a snack for later kind of a thing. I love their shoe, shoestring fries at Divinity Schnitzel. We have ways to make you talk. So good. So, man, this will wake you up after a hangover, uh, a party. Your Aunt Connie will love it. Something, man. These fries. Boy, this is some good vittles. Boy, this will whew, put your, knock your Aunt Connie's socks off. The heat on this thing. There it is, the Aunt Connie reference. I love it when he says that. So now, heat-wise, I don't like a... I got a one to four. This is like a... Definitely a three. Woo, 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 woo. Mm. Well, they're that spicy. I, I guess I've never tried that sauce before. I'd try it just without the cheese. Let me know if what you guys would do. If, if would you try it? I'm a, I, I'm not. I'm a sucker when it comes to, to um, spicy foods. Like I really don't like getting my mouth burnt when I eat them, but I'm always willing to take on the experience if it's something I haven't tried before with the spicy food. But I want to know what you guys have to say about it in the comments down below. Would you try it? Would you try these fries? I do it without the cheese. That's my one condition. <laughs> Mm -hmm. So the top two swings. Listen, Joey's a man of class and distinction. That's all you can really say about him. The man has a refined palate, okay? He was able to differentiate out the taste of the fry, out the taste of the jalapeno, the taste of the sauce, and the taste of the cheese. That's a feat that no mere man has ever accomplished. The chili, everything swings on this. And the jalapenos. Wow, good stuff. That Wiener Schnitzel. On a scale of 1 to 10. I'm giving this a nice 8.5. That's pretty good. Top of Tio Chili Cheese Fries from that Wiener Schnitzel. We have this to make you talk. That's right, get there, be square. You know what's funny? I've only ever seen one video where this guy doesn't like the food that he's reviewing. And it's because they didn't give him a receipt. Check out my tweets and my twerts and everything in between. While he's plugging, I might as well plug as well. I got my Twitter down in the description right next to my Patreon and my Instagram links. But I'll have links at the end of the video as well to kind of remind you. So check out my tweets and twerts too. Uh, shirts for the, uh, the ladies in your life. Joey, I'm a level with you, alright? I, myself, and a lot of guys that I know 
would not be willing to go out to your website to buy your shirts with your face on the front and, and be willing to give them to a girl that we like. That's just not something that would that we would do. Anyways, thank you so much for tuning in. This is that of Inner Sensil's Top of Tio Chili Cheese Fries. It is awesome. It is good. You will be one happy camper. You know, I'm already one happy camper. That's pretty much Joey's video right there. Like I said, let me know in the comments down below, guys. What do you think? Does that, did that look good? I don't deny that it might have tasted delicious. I'm a sucker for fries, like I said. But... It just didn't look good, man. The cheese is what ruined it for me. But I want to know what you guys have to say about it as well. If while you guys are down there, there is a thumbs up button and a subscribe button. If you did that, I'd be pretty thankful. That'd be awesome. How cool would it be if everyone who enjoyed the video went ahead and hit those buttons? I would absolutely love it. I'd enjoy it. But only do that if you really enjoyed the video. I really appreciate, though, the feedback that you guys get right there. And I have some links right here that you guys should check out. It's the Twitter, Patreon, Instagram, stuff like that. Feel free to check those out. I like to talk back and forth with you guys. I love contacting you guys and just having these conversations and that feedback. So I appreciate it. That being said, hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day.